Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jasmine Chiswell and today's video is going to be something extra special. I'm going to have my husband Maverick here and we're going to discuss about how we met. So without further ado you guys, let's get started. It's like really stuck in here. Tim's like at the track. Oh, here we go, it's coming out. Just waiting for Maverick to get his ice cream sandwich. Look at this. It does look good. Can you get a bite? Nope. Hey, <laughs> nope. No, nope. Please. Nope. Please. Nope. That's me. I just want a bite. Mm. Oh, well, uh, cookie's too hard. Okay, oh, I just I want curse. It. Oops. It's too hard. Uh. Oh. Cool. <laughs> Tastes good. Come on. Okay. Like far away. I'm in this big seat and you're in like. Okay, you guys, so a lot of people have asked us how we met, and I've been meaning to make this video, and today's the day where we're going to make this video. Yay! Yay! Stop! <laughs> okay, so as you know, I'm my turn, <laughs> and he's my Lucky you. <laughs> Lucky you too. Oh, you're in touch. So basically, I moved to America in 2016 and I came here to do my master's in film production because I worked in film for a long time and I just wanted a little change of scenery and I came to LA for a year. And my course was really, really intense so I was studying about seven days a week and it was just constant, non-stop. And the lady I was staying with, she was like, okay, like you should go on a dating app. And I was at the time, I was like, I'm too young for dating apps. I thought that was for like older people. And I didn't, I was like, I don't know. I don't want to like go on a dating app. I don't know. There's like some weird, I don't know. Some people think it's weird. Mm. What do you think? <laughs> dating apps are, I don't know how to say it without being bad. But to be honest, a lot of people think dating apps are like embarrassing or mm -hmm. whatever. And I was one of those people. I would, I was like, I will never go on a dating app absolutely ever i was like I, I won't do it like i could just meet someone the old-fashioned way whatever and then uh i realized that, that wasn't gonna happen so i just went on it and uh i met her so i'm glad i did yeah. so if anyone tells you don't go on a dating app if you don't want to you don't have to but you never it know works. you never know uh, yeah it's the crazy thing so it it's worked. crazy because like when i first came here I, and when i went on a dating app it was like I don't know, like, I went on some really, really crazy dates, and dates, like, I didn't even think, I don't know, I never expect people to act that way, it was just so weird and bizarre, and most of the dates I went on, a lot of the guys were just like, I just want to hear your accent. Oh, and my ear fell. <laughs> 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 so yeah, they just wanted to hear my accent, and I always felt that they didn't want to know me for me. So it kind of put me off, and I didn't really want to go back on the dating, like, site. So I was just focusing a lot on my work and my studies and then I matched with Maverick and we spoke <laughs> for a little bit like just on and off on the app because the app is Bumble and on that app at the time, I don't know if it's changed now, by the time the girl has to message the guy first and you only have 24 hours, once you match you have 24 hours to send him a message and then he has 24 hours to respond to me right? That's mm -hmm. correct. Yeah the so, girl had to put in all the hard work. Yeah we had to say <laughs> hi. Um, so we just spoke on the app for like maybe like a few, like two weeks or something because I was always busy, he was busy with his music and stuff so it wasn't like constant and you're in the same boat as me as far as you told me that like you weren't really wanting to date around. I just, you know, I was just dating to see and hopefully I'd meet someone but I wasn't, it wasn't like the, the needed thing. It wasn't, it wasn't like, oh I have to be with someone. You know, you just meet people and if something happens that's great, you know. Mm -hmm. Of course everyone wants to be with someone but you can't live your life trying like I have to be with someone. Just meet people, go with it, and then it'll it'll happen naturally. Yeah. And that's how it happened. Yeah. yeah. So <laughs> we then met up and he took me to the beach on our first date. <laughs> how original of me, huh? <laughs> For so me it is. So creative. 
For me it is because I'm from Scotland and if you guys are from Scotland or if anyone's been to Scotland you know that going to the beach is like a rarity because it's always so cold. <laughs> so it was nice to go to the beach and we hung out a little bit and we went to we went to get something to eat. And then we just sat in the car and chatted, like literally the full time. <laughs> That's such a big excuse. It's so guys. good. It's so good. I, I'm supposed to be like invested in this conversation, but I know. that thing is so good. <laughs> Better than our relationship, right? <laughs> oh my God. I'm kidding. <laughs> it's insane. It is good, isn't it? It matches me. It does match you. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm, I'm missing it already. I'm missing it. <laughs> Please give it back. It is really good. Okay, so after our first date, it went really well, and basically we hung out every single day since then. And I think we've only really had like maybe three weeks apart since we've been together. Oh. Like literally from the beginning. Oof. <laughs> you hear that, guys? No, it's been good. Um, I went to Scotland actually for Christmas in 2017, right? Mm -hmm. 2016. 2016. I oh, think. whatever. Sometime. I think it was 2016, and that was the longest time we've been apart from each other. So I was away for three three weeks, and then I came back, and we've been together pretty much every day ever since we worked together. Obviously, we lived together, and I moved in with him pretty quickly. It was maybe within like six months. Yeah, it was fast. It was faster than six it months. I don't know what you're talking four about. Four months, maybe. No, it was. It, no, it had I met to be faster. In August. September, no, November, it had to be, January. No, it had to be faster than that. When we met, I think you moved in within like three months. I moved in in January and we started dating. I guess we started dating in September. Yes, it was about and three months. And I moved months. in in January, no, it's four months. Four months, fine, fine. Four months. I moved in after four months and it was a crazy story, like genuinely a crazy story about how I had to move in. And that is for another video, you guys. Um, I'm not gonna believe it. <laughs> So basically, we moved in and we, well, Maverick had two dogs. He had Rick and Gus. And this guy. <laughs> and Gus is sleeping. This is Rick. Oh, big Ricky. The only, he's only here because he cares about this. <laughs> he likes that he's mm. And Gus, well, Gus, come here. No, he's like, he's the biggest chihuahua you've ever This guy right here. Seen. You see his head? Let's bring him up. Oh, this is Gus, you guys. So Maverick had Gus and Rick when I first moved in with him. And he's really warm. He's been sunbathing. Hey, Gussie. Um, and then we got Ben, which is this one here. <laughs> My little shadow. He follows me everywhere. And um, we got Ben. And then we got Timmy. Timmy. We got them. We got Ben and Timmy at the same time. Come here, Timmy. <laughs> so this is Tim. Um, so we got them at the same time. I just forgot to show you Ben. I realized that. Here is Ben. <laughs> He's interested in ice cream too. I know that. So basically we got four dogs and we had just moved in. It was like really, really quickly. Like once, oh Ben. <laughs> once um, we started living together. So it was like really hectic. So we just moved in and then we have four dogs to take care of. So it was stupid stupid decision <laughs> i love every one of them i think yeah. they're so great they're great dogs I, anyone work. who has four kids i give them so much credit it's a lot that is work. hard work and hard work at the time like our our place wasn't that big so it was pretty hard mm -hmm. to deal with the four of them um, and especially when we're in a new relationship as well it was it was i don't know what were we thinking I know, we love animals so much, so when we went to the adoption center, we wanted to adopt even more, and my earrings fell out again. Guys, I don't know, this, this is not good. <laughs> so basically, so basically, yeah, so we got four dogs, and, and then pretty, like, I don't know, maybe like after a few months later, we got engaged, and then, like, I don't know, like six months later, we got married. And that's, that's really our story. <laughs> that? Um, no, this is weird. Oh, fine. Take it. No, no, hold it, hold it. 
You gotta eat the rest. I'm, I can't I eat can that. Eat I'm watching myself eat it on camera, and it's like disgusting. But I can't stop. You guys, if you want this ice cream, grab it to the phone. Yeah. <laughs> hey, let me throw it to you. Hoosh. Imagine you did. Hoosh. Well, it'll just ruin the. So I used to do a transition to that on TikTok, and we throw an ice cream and you catch. <laughs> That'd be something. Oh, that would be so cool, huh? <laughs> So, so that's really how we met. Um, nothing really crazy. It was just like on a dating app and we went on a few dates. I mean, that's kind of crazy depending on how you look at it. Yeah, okay, so yeah, no dating app, like it's weird because if I didn't match with him, because I could easily have swiped away and he didn't match. Um, or wait, I, or, wait, you could have easily swiped away? <laughs> well, he could have swiped away and I could have swiped away and then we might not have matched, and then, I don't know, like, girls only have 24 hours, like, what if I didn't make my phone? Yep. What if that didn't happen? I'd have a much better life, I'd be so much happier. <laughs> Me too! Oh, shut up! <laughs> <laughs> We're joking, We're obviously, joking. for We're anyone who doesn't understand that. We're pretty sarcastic in our relationship, we, yeah. we like to, like, have fun and joke around a lot. <laughs> I know a few people didn't really understand our first video that we did together because we're always pretty joking with each no, other. We joke around. We joke around yeah. all the time. <laughs> but, <laughs> but no, so, oh, I nearly fell off my chair. Um, but no, it was like, it's just weird to think about that that just happened. And I did not expect to, to, to marry an American. I didn't, like, I thought I'd go back to Scotland and that would be it. Like, I didn't think that I would be living here and oh met maverick and yeah it's like bizarre to think right yeah i mean i don't think anyone knows who they're gonna be with so no but usually happens. you're with someone from the same country that's just usually yeah. how it happens but you never know and if it if they're not then who cares mm -hmm. you love the person that's all that matters yeah. so yeah so that's really it like it seems kind of like a boring story we used to always say people go oh. It seems like a boring story. I think it's an exciting story. I think our relationship is is a great story. Yeah, I, think I think how we so. met is fun. It's we met fun. on the internet, which is embarrassing in itself, <laughs> but it worked out, so I can't hate on it. Yep. I would judge anyone. Oh, why are you going on Tinder, on Bumble? Why are you on all these apps? And then I go on, on Bumble, and then I meet her, and, and whatever. It was. I'm happy I did it. Never works. And that's yeah. the thing, like the same for us, like we went out a few times and we told people, cause people are like, oh, we met and we met at this bar and you know, we're the last people there. And then it just happened, you know, or he dropped his bag and I picked it up and we are just like, we met on Bumble. <laughs> and we don't have like a nice, no, a nice old fashioned but story for like us, that. like, it's still a nice story, like because we met and the date was like really amazing and I don't know, you're just polite and everything. It was like, honestly, like, I went that, like, that changed after three or four months. <laughs> no, I went on a few dates here, you guys, and literally a guy grabbed my food. Like, genuinely. And, like, I didn't think I could go on dates again because I felt so uncomfortable. That's gross. It's not right. That's so, just, that's low class. Yeah, like, that's not good. it was, like, really, really bad. And it was just, like, I didn't think that I would date anyone here. And then, obviously, I met my big and... He was great, he was a gentleman and always is, and he takes care of me, and he's my best friend, so. Oh, thank you, that was very sweet. Okay. Genuinely, that was actually sweet. <laughs> I love you. I love you. I was gonna make a joke, but I was like, no, I make too many jokes. No. I'm always making stupid jokes every second. I'm like, that was actually a nice thing to say, so I'm not gonna make a joke. Yeah, so yeah, I just couldn't imagine my life without him. So, we are like two peas in a pod. <laughs> two peas in a pod. Bees in the buck, da, 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 da. This is really shit. This is why we don't do TikTok dances, you guys. I know, we're not even on rhythm. Go, 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 go. Two peas in a buck. Okay, so basically my phone ran out of storage, so I had to delete some clips and it cut us off while we were dancing. Dancing? Oh, yeah. How could you forget? It's only like two seconds ago. It was a minute ago, but still, I forgot that so, we were dancing. But yeah, so that is really the story of how we met you guys. And yeah, so that's how we're together. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, 
please leave a like and a comment and don't forget to share the video and subscribe and thank you all so much 110,000 subscribers you guys are so amazing and you all mean the world to me so thank you all so much and yeah and here's the magic and I'll definitely bring him into more of my videos so stay tuned so if you have any other video suggestions please leave them in the comments or you could send me a text uh, my number is 310 Oh, I'm going to give you my number. <laughs> Not unless you work for it. Uh, I don't know you guys. And I will see you all over on my TikTok, on my Instagram, and back here in the next few days. Oh, I draw some chairs up. <laughs> and I'm Maverick Green Newly. <laughs> Hi. Okay, well, bye. <laughs> bye.